Hey, it's just me here. Today is March 20th, 2024. The time for me is 3.07 a.m. This is a brand new Sagittarius reading. No projecting, a clear understanding, a truthful understanding now. It really may resonate with you and it may not to take what is, leave the rest. Only my angels and ancestors are allowed to the Sagittarius reading I'm about to get ready to do for y'all. You're coming back, hey, you new welcome. I am taking personal personal readings at is just a reading at gmail.com. It's just a reading at gmail.com. Sun, moon, and rising Sagittarius. Let's tap into your energy. I'm very honest. So if you don't like it, go ahead and click out of the video now. I don't sugarcoat shit, so. I'm not here to sing you a song or a lullaby. I'm here to get down to the bottom of what's going on in your future, past, and your present, okay? Because that's what tarot is. Let's see what's going on with Sagittarius. And I'm going to shuffle this way three times. For Sagittarius, first card that came out right here. Oh, shit. That's the Eight of Swords. Trapped here? Somebody trapped. Is that Scar? These are, um... These are Disney cards, y'all. So this looks like Scar from The Lion King. He trapped here. So somebody's trapped. I don't know if this is you or this is somebody else. Remember, this doesn't have to be a lover. This could be a family member. This could be one of your kids. Cheryl is not all just about love, okay? It could be other uh, family situations, work-related can be all of that okay y'all could be trapped at work something got something to do with work you could be trapped in a love situation be trapped in your mind mentally about something here but something with the world a cycle here something that was ongoing at a distance with something here all right look like this is the i ain't got my glasses okay now this to me that came out of that one You got the devil here. Okay, some type of temptations here. Capricorn energy. You can have Capricorn in your chart. Emperor Aries energy here. Let me move these up. The magician, somebody could be doing some type of trickery here, some type of um, spell work. This is the Seven of Pentacles. The Six of Pentacles. We got a Six of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody here could be messing with your money. The reason why I said that is because the devil is right underneath it, I mean, right above it. The Knight of Coins. Swords Virgo Capricorn energy here. Strong uh, Capricorn energy. The Ace of Wands. Some type of new beginning. A new start. A new flow. A new system. I don't know who got you trapped here or who's trapped here, but somebody is trapped right here. They can't move. They stuck. They got something to do with some type of cycle because the devil is here right next to that cycle. Maybe some type of addictions are on the rise. 
Somebody could have a drinking addiction, could have a gambling addiction. It could be any addiction. It could be an obsession as well. Toxicity is around you. Maybe somebody is toxic. Some got something to do with some type of addictions and obsessions. You could be obsessed with something or somebody could be obsessed with you here. Somebody don't want you to move. The emperor is here. Some type of independence here, though. Right above that uh, eight of swords, you still want to be independent and be in control of something. But maybe right now you can't. Maybe something's not going as planned right here with that world and that magician underneath. Maybe somebody is trying to put a pause and trying to mess with uh, manifestation here with your money, your love, your wands, and your truth. Remember, the magician manifests in his pinnacles, the cups, the swords, and the wands. Some got something to do with this money here, with this three, um, with this three, of, um, the six of pentacles, six of coins with the devil here. Somebody could be playing with your money here, not of coins. Now, I don't know who the fuck this is, but there's somebody right here that's very tentative and is keeping a close eye on something. The nine of coins keeps a close eye on whatever is in front of them when it got something to do with some money. So they move kind of fast and swift here. They may be trying to get rich quick schemes here that get rich quick scheme talk about the uh eight of swords who the hell got you trapped here or got want somebody to be trapped you got the three of wands here in reverse remember you are wand sagittarius because you're fire in the chart Somebody don't want you to think for yourself or they don't want you to move. They don't want no steady progression here. I don't know who the fuck this is and I don't know who they think they are. I'm trying to keep you stuck here. Yeah, somebody playing some real dirty deed, some dirty game here. Five of Swords, this could be a, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here that's trying to keep you stuck. They trying to win at all costs. Somebody trying to keep you down. Who the fuck? I ain't feeling this person's energy. They making me mad already. And I, I be having my mixed emotions with my cards. I show emotion because I really be into this shit. This is not no for entertainment purposes. I do these cards to get truth. I play sometimes when it's needed, but this ain't nothing to play with. Somebody up here is very greedy here. They don't want to see you move here. And they don't want to see you leave. So they're going to try to win at all costs here with this sword energy. I'm not feeling it. Say more about this Libra, Gemini, Aquarius person. This could be somebody at y'all job, too. Somebody envious as fuck. Who is this person that doesn't want Sagittarius to move? Want them to stay stuck and want them to lose. Thank you. The five of coins. Somebody wants you to lose. The five of coins is losing. That's a loss. Hardship. Somebody wants you to lose money here. Somebody, yeah, this could be somebody at y'all. Y'all Sagittarius, y'all be careful. Somebody don't want to see you get some type of promotion or don't want to see you move up here. Or somebody don't want to see you keep pushing forward towards something that you want. Somebody is trying to keep you stuck here. Now, I don't know who this is. This could very well be your mind keeping you stuck, too. But there's there no, there's another energy here that's trying to keep you stuck. I can't make it up. You got the three of wands in reverse. That's delay all day. Wands are delayed if they're in reverse. The, uh, look it up. You know what I'm saying? Five of swords. That's somebody that's trying to win. That's being greedy. That wants you to lose. But what a coincidence. There go the five of coins. That's a loss. Hardship. Losing a job. Loss, 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 loss. Talk about the world. Is this somebody at a distance or is this somebody that wants some type of change to happen? Okay. So, two of these came out and I'm not taking two. I want one. Well, I don't like this. Thank you so much. Some type of justice. Scales is going to get balanced though for you. Equality. What, Libra?
some of you guys could have that Libra in y'all chart. Mm -mm, one. There you go. Shit. You got the nine of swords here. <sighs> Somebody can't sleep. This could have something to do with imprisonment and in the law here. Somebody could have got in trouble. And that's probably why they trapped. Somebody may be trying to send you to jail too. Don't be overthinking it though. I'm not saying that's for sure. But for somebody, somebody's trying to send somebody to jail. They want them to lose their job and want somebody to go to jail. King of Wands in reverse. It could be this King of Wands. Somebody impulsive and they mad as fuck and they don't not want to see something go here. Like somebody could have fire in their chart too. Somebody got either that that uh sword and that fire in their chart. Somebody mad here. They can't sleep, they got insomnia here. Can't go to bed. Why this person got evil intentions here with this devil? The queen of coins in reverse. Yeah. You better motherfucker. You you broke too. This ain't you, queen of swords. Somebody broke. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. Strong Capricorn energy here. Male or female. Switch the roles. This could be a female that's hating on you, Sagittarius uh, female. This could be a male hating on you, Sagittarius male. Somebody do not want to see you win here. Yeah, they in a lot of sword energy. Look at this shit. You got the, um, you know, you got the seven of swords here. Somebody's so sneaky. Like, they evil. They plotting on something really bad here. They plot and they want to see you lose. This person, they got that sword energy. That's why I'm saying they got a lot of sword energy. Whoever this person is, this queen of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, they do not want... Somebody wants to keep you hooked and keep you rattled in with them and want to keep you stuck. And this person look like they obsessed with you. Like, they can't just seem to leave you the fuck alone. You know, once again, you got this nine. You got this nine of, uh, energy whoever this woman is mm -mm. not like this motherfucker talk about the emperor you wanted your control and independence back and somebody trying to keep you here hermit this is about to get ready and cause you to uh go ahead and just dip because this person is trying to force shit that don't fit here. This person is manipulative as fuck too. 
I don't know where you was at before, but whoever you was with before, whoever you was where you was at before, because before this happened, you were straight somewhere else. Talk about the hermit. Yeah, you got judgment here that's almost in reverse, but I'm going to take it up. You're going to have to go under a judgment, Sagittarius, in order to get up out of this situation. The angels is about to get ready and be like, nope, let me get you up out the way. You need to leave Sagittarius alone. you about to get ready and go under judgment. This going to require you, and the hermit and judgment ain't nothing to play with. Because what's going to happen is, is that this person is about to get ready and push you so far to the deep end. Where you're going to say deuces and you're going to leave and you're going to go somewhere secluded. And that's when the angels are going to come in. When you're by yourself and you have no one around, that's the perfect time to find spiritual awakening. And something's about to get right happen spiritually to you. Because you got somebody right here that's doing some deceptive ass shit. They being very sneaky here. And they could very well be cheating. This could be the person you're dealing with, dating, baby mother, uh, wife girlfriend boyfriend whoever you're dealing with with the sword energy yeah the high priestess is about to get ready to come damn this shit the energy right now is like making me kind of like um jittery this is strong oh man hold on mm -mm. i need a drink Didn't I tell y'all that you about to get ready and go on a spiritual attack right here? The high priestess is a spiritual woman who stays by herself, who may come off a little bit mysterious here. This is like Pisces energy too. So um, somebody about to get ready and come in spiritually about to get ready and have a talk with you about this person here. The ancestors is about to get ready and, and shake shit up with this person. This person could very, I, I'm just, look, I, I know y'all probably don't want to hear it. I'm not finna sugarcoat. This person is cheating too. You got that seven of swords there. That's cheating, lying, stealing here. They still in energy. They could be an energy vampire. You may get so tired of when you be dealing with this person. Don't even want to deal with them. Probably be looking at them like, oh, I can't stand you, bro. Like, it, it's to the point where this person is doing too much. They're overstepping their boundaries here. They doing some type of spell work right here on uh, Sagittarius. What's, on, what's up with that? There go Empress. Yes, this could be a baby mother. For some of you guys, Sagittarius, this could be a baby mother. This could be a sister or a woman that has kids. For you, Sagittarius woman, this could be a woman that got kids. They're broke as fuck here. They don't have no money. Ugh. Holding on to their last with that four coins. man five of cups regret yeah somebody about to get ready and move forward here the uh, five of cups in reverse is uh when it's up that means somebody's regretting some crying over spilled milk looking at the the damage that they've done here but then when it's in reverse that means somebody is forgiving and just going ahead and moving forward they're not finna continue to keep on putting up with this this is looking like your energy this person is very much broke Whoever this baby mother is, baby father, whoever this is, they broke and they miserable as fuck here. A very strong baby mother, very strong sister that's pregnant here or somebody that's pregnant. Very fucking mean. Very mean and evil and broke and funky. Talk about this six of coins. This was somebody that you were sharing something with. Could have been sharing a home with this person. Some of y'all are married to this person too. Or a baby mother, baby father situation. Joint custody. Hearing that too. The fool. Yeah, you took a risk with this person. Remember that last video I told you? I said you made a mistake. Don't do it again. Yep, you did. You made a mistake. I don't care what you said. Queen of Cups. There's a Queen of Cups here. This could very well be your energy, Pisces female. No, you took a, tr uh, a trip and wanted to give love to this person. Y'all could have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio in y'all chart. Yeah. Now you don't want this person four cups. You made a big, big mistake here. Four cups with somebody that's not interested no more. They're done. <laughs> Hell no. You think I'm bullshitting. There go the Eight of Cups. You walking away or about to. Y'all be thinking somebody playing.
Ugh. Tell me more about this Knight of Coins. Where is this Knight of Coins going? They going off somewhere else. Like, this man look like he getting the fuck out of Dodge. Trying to find somewhere else to go. <laughs> I'm weak. Yeah. Yeah. This Sorry, Sagittarius. Um, I don't know where we stopped that at. Um, but I pulled these cards right here. This is, like I said, this is the Ten of Swords. Feeling defeated here. Feeling tired here. King of Wands energy. Somebody tired here. Yeah, like I said, this person right here, I pulled these cards right here. If y'all didn't get somebody right here, you was working with, tired of working with this person, took a chance on somebody here, gave some love, king of, queen of cups, king of cups, switch the roles, male, female, Sagittarius, tired of this motherfucker now, four of cups, not interested no more in this person. This person is burning you the fuck out. This is too much for you. This person is doing too much. They evil, manipulated, cheating, lying, stealing, keeping up bullshit, very cold. Um, want to do what they want to do. This motherfucker think they can just do what they want to do. Not a coins. You getting up out here trying to find somewhere new to go money wise here. This is the uh, nine of swords. Can't sleep. Insomnia. Taking it all in at once. Up all night trying to trying to uh, chase your dreams. But your dreams is chasing you. The strength right here. You need Leo energy. You need to get up. Get brave. Get your shit back to where it was. Stop being stuck here. Three of coins in reverse. No teamwork, no uh, no working, disharmony, off. Somebody could be stealing here. Um, yeah, mm -mm. Well, you was working with this person. Ain't no working with this person no more. Talk about the Ace of Wands. You ready to go somewhere new. Sound away with the Six of Swords. Yeah, you ready to get the fuck up out of there. You have heartbreak, separation. It's about to be a separation right here. Three of swords. You about to get rain. Get on. Talk to us. Man. It's too much. Y'all dealing with somebody that is just like crazy here. This motherfucker is so damn... Um, out of pocket, this motherfucker probably make you want to really tweak up on them. The shit they doing. King of Coins came out in reverse and they broke. How you broke and ignorant? Pick a struggle. Yup, Knight of Cups. This person immature, but they fucking love. This is like a player to me. Knight of Cups, Princess of Cups is a player. Player female, player male. That's why you about to get ready and separate yourself from this person. They showing a real immature here. Yep, Ace of Coins came out in reverse. There ain't no money making here with this person. First, they could give a fuck unless they only care about what they care about. Two of swords, you about to get ready and avoid they ass. You know, your nine of cups is in reverse here. Mm -mm. Yeah, you got your nine of swords, your ten of swords right here. All this shit is in reverse. Mm -mm, I wouldn't be putting up with this. I'm sorry my camera had uh, turned off, y'all. But I'm back. Uh, let me see what the fuck is going on with this, though. I'm not liking this. You're not interested no more. Yep, you about to get ready and leave. Your intuition is telling something more about this ignorant-ass person here. Yeah, let's see. They broke and ignorant. You know, when I look at the queen, you know, over here with this, you know, this deception, this seven of swords, this person look like they just, they don't care about what you say. 
They feel like you gonna stay and do what they tell you to do. Oh, is you gonna stay or is you gonna leave? They could be holding a child or something over you right here or making you speak, uh, stay so you won't leave them. Tell you more about this wicked ass energy. I can't stand this shit. This type of stuff be getting me mad. Tell me more about this queen of swords and you, you just look like you ain't shit. Look at how she look. That's the mother from, um, that's Cinderella, if I'm not mistaken. If I'm not mistaken, I think that's her. What's up with you, queen of wands? Why are you so possessive? Yep, it's about to be a tower between you and her. Male or female, King of Wands. I mean, King of Swords. Tell us more about you, Queen of Swords. Why are you so, um... What's wrong with you? Why are you acting like that? Why you won't let Sagittarius move and do what they want to do, but you could just, do, but you feel like you could do what you want to do? It don't work like that. What's finna get ready to happen with the situation? I want one card. Thank you. Yep, you about to get ready and get avoided, boo. You about to get ready and avoid they ass. The tower is coming right here with the two of swords. This is what's about to get ready and happen. Mm hmm? You about to get ready and get the boot. And this could very well be them too about to get ready and ignore you. You about to get ready and move on from this Queen of Swords. Why? You up two of wands. Because it's not working out. It's delays. I'm tired of this person. Here you go right here. Queen of Wands right there. That's you, um, Sagittarius. Leo Sagittarius, Aries, Wands is y'all energy, fire. You about to get ready to get back into your independence, Sagittarius male. Sagittarius female. You about to get ready and just stop this shit. You about to get ready and be independent again, be by yourself. Talk about the high priest is about to get ready and take over here. Who is this pride priest is about to make you find some type of clarity, some truth, and stick by yourself and be spiritual again, having a high intuition. You probably think that this person is also cheating on you too, lying and stealing too. You guys know something is up. Y'all not stupid here. Yup. Six of Cups. Bad memories and stuff right here. Thinking about the past really bad here. Talking more about this cup energy. High priestess here. Mm -mm. Too many cards. We only want one. The Nine of Cups. I don't know if this is somebody from y'all past here. Because this is the Six of Cups here. Somebody from your past. I don't know if you want to come back to them. This high priestess. High priest. But it's somebody from your past that you see a Nine of Cups. When I'm about to get ready and clarify that. But you're not interested in who no more. You done. You're not finna drink from somebody else's cup here. Mm-mm. 
you have some type of confusion and illusions it's like strong cup energy right here is you is, is, is there a, a pisces cancer or scorpio involved with this does this person not want you no more are you trying to go back to somebody else here let me see the higher font came out in reverse not practicing what you preach as a teacher as a priest as a master king of cups damn there's some strong cup energy right here um let me see what's going on with this right here um so there is somebody else here some kind of cup energy but i don't know if this is somebody maybe you confused about here Cause you about to start somewhere new here. I see reconciliation with two of cups. Is you trying to reconcile with somebody else? Is that another person here? Somebody could be getting a rest with the four uh with the four of swords and the eight of pentacles here trying to work trying to stay okay so who is this who is this strong cup energy who is this tell us who this cup energy is it's my other tarot deck y'all who is this cup energy this is somebody that could be spiritual with judgment who's watching you protecting you this could be a loved one that passed away I see that page of swords. Who is this cup energy? They're showing up right here. Ace of cups. So this is some new love. Hierophant act like he wanted to come out, but I wanted it to shuffle and come out. We are gonna pull four. Tell us more about this love. More cup energy, this shit crazy. This is somebody you might've sailed away from. You might've sailed away from this person for that other fucked up person. Or either this is, this is the person that sailed away from you. Tell us more about this person. There go the six of swords right there. Oh shit, there's somebody that could be watching you. Page of swords, three of swords, collaborating. This could be somebody new that's watching you, Sagittarius, that like you. Tell me more, I just want one though. This could be a cancer with this water. Somebody that moves fast, they're trying to come back in, or you trying to come towards them. Tell me more about this person. Oh, this person's a high priestess. They look kind of mysterious here, but this is them. They go on with things, they move. They may come off a little secretive and mysterious. You probably want to know more about this person. Oh shit. Somebody is here though. Somebody else is here besides that fucked up um, sword energy. Let me see. Tell me more about this person for Sagittarius, please. Tell us more info about this person with the cosmic insight. I see pregnancy at the bottom. And cuts could be a uh, proposal, pregnancy too, a baby and stuff with that dove right there. Tell me more about this person. Open your heart. It will help you attract more. So maybe open your heart to this person. I say no, it's not the right time. Cause maybe they might've sailed away. This is somebody you could have had communication issues with Mercury retrograde issues, reviewing everything. Oh, here they go. Water sign. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. That shit flew out. Okay, um, Sagittarius, I ain't lying to you now. Look, there go the proof in the pudding. 
it's somebody else here that's a water sign that you were you're thinking about. They could be thinking about you too and want to come back and reconcile or talk to you because Ace of Cups could be reconciliation as well. Wanted to uh, start something new here. Fire sign. There you go. Aries, Theo, Sagittarius. Y'all right there next to each other. Y'all could be moving. Your intuition about something bad, though. Damn. Tell me more about this water and fire sign, please. A child. You and this water or fire sign could share a child together, or this is about a child, or you want to share a child with them. There's a child involved. You guys are distant. You guys may have went on a different journey here. One more for this water and fire sign. A message of concern. Somebody may get a message that's going to concern them. Tell me more about this water and fire sign with the life cards. Tell us more about you, Sagittarius, and this water sign. Somebody may feel abandoned like an orphan here. This could be you or them. Tell us more. One. Lessons and blessings. This person could have been a lesson and a blessing for you. Don't look like somebody that you just met though this is somebody definitely from the past Ugh. excuse me because them cars just flew okay This person, this other person here taught you a lot. This person could very well be an older female male high priestess. They could be very deep into tarot themselves. Or have just like a very strong gift. But you do too. You're very strong too, high priest, high priestess, high priest, um, Sagittarius. Yep, this is some love right here. Love life. This is some deep passion too. So y'all had a love life. You and this water sign. I saw Asian. Somebody could be Asian. I saw Celtic. I saw that last night. Health. Something got something to do with y'all. Health and trees growing here. Forgiveness. Damn. Let me get one of these heart cards right here. I'm going to go into with these. These little heart shaped cards to see what they want to say. I'm going to pull two. Tell us more about this uh, water sign in Sagittarius. One.
tell us more about Sagittarius and this water sign. It says transformation. Your relationship with one another is about deepening. Love conquers all, transforms all things. Okay, so something about to get ready to transform between you and this person. You and this water sign. Hell no. Secret admirer. Someone has deeper feelings for you than they're letting on. Yeah, this is this water sign here that you're talking to. Damn. Tell us more about... Um, we're going to go on to the crosswords. Um, crosswords. Crossroads. Cards. We're going to pull four here. Then I'm gonna get some uh, yin yang oracles for y'all. This other little, this um, sword energy look like they finna get ready and get the boot. You already about to get ready and boot them on and get them the fuck up out of here. Confusion. You may be confused or they may be confused here about something. You and this water sign. Completion. Somebody wants some type of completion. They want something to be done here. I see miracle and bittersweet, but I only want one. Quest, some type of quest. And destiny. This is destiny here. Ooh. Yeah, this right here ain't no joke. Whoever this other person is. Um let me get into these yin yang oracles and see what they gotta say. And then I'm going to go ahead and pull some cards and see what this water sign wants to say to you. But let's see what the yin yang got to say. Yep, I see a divine feminine here. A strong feminine energy for you Sagittarius male. I see hot and attraction coming out. Y'all very hot and attracted to each other here. Talk about it. Somebody could feel guilty for something here. Maybe it was you that left this person or they could have left you here and they feeling kind of guilty for leaving or you feeling guilty for leaving. Somebody left somebody here, but somebody was comfort here. Somebody was a, a comfort to somebody. I guess y'all was both like on each other's comfort zone here and somebody's clinging on to somebody. This could be you clinging on to them or they could be clinging on to you. Some type of decisions need to be made, though. I saw decisions act like they wanted to fly out. Y'all both probably was comfort comfortable with, with each other. I can't even talk, child. This shit is too much. What is that? Attraction? Look, I told y'all Attraction Mars came out. Y'all very highly attracted to each other. You and this water sign. Woo. A union right here. Integration. One more. You may see a soulmate twin flame or something. Epiphany breakthrough. Chemistry passion. Y'all got a damn family home. This person is, yeah, this person does it for you. That other person you was dealing with, they ain't even doing it for you. That motherfucker coming up as a loser. Let me see what they got to say to you on the Naked Truth right here. We're going to go into the Naked Truth Oracle cards. 
What you want to say to Sagittarius, water sign? Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. What do you want to say to the Sagittarius? What you want to say? I keep looking at your pictures, not to mention the videos we made. Oh my God, I will never delete them. So they looking at stuff that y'all made. I'm going through a lot right now. I need space and time to gather my thoughts, okay? So they could be going through a lot right now. What else you want to say to Sagittarius? Sun, moon, and rising. I look at my phone every day hoping I would see a message from you. They want to talk to you. Somebody want to talk to you. Throw it on the cards. Mm -hmm. I'm at a crossroads. Should I fight for this or move on? Relationships are a lot. Being single is easier. Okay, so this person could be single. You know, they was at a crossroads probably. You know, you was probably in a relationship and... They didn't know they probably wanted to fight. You was in a relationship with somebody else for sure that did you wrong. So they don't even know what they want to do. Like, they don't know if they want to fight for this and still deal with you or what. But they do miss you. But this person right here has good intentions. I ain't seen not one bad thing with this person at all. This water sign. So whoever this water sign was, they was loving you better than the person that you, that you, uh, that you left them for. Look at Pisces. I believe y'all just got something to do with them. <laughs> y'all dealing with a Pisces or something here. If you believe this is going to work out and you believe this person and you care about this person, go back. Right. meditation brings answers and at the bottom in the near future so something to happen in the near future probably with you and this person and we're gonna go ahead and get a bible scripture card we're gonna go ahead and get up out of here okay Sagittarius this reading was a hot mess what does the angels want to say to you the Heavenly Father will say, What so shall do the will of my Father, which is in heaven? The same as my brother and sister and mother. So you give the same love that you would give to your Father in heaven. Sister, mother, brother, cousin. Dad, mom, whoever. Yeah, um, if somebody else here want to love you. You left them for somebody else to something here, or you probably just not, you don't probably know who this is. This could be a secret admirer. This could be somebody at your job. This could be somebody on the internet that you was talking to. That's a water sign. This could be someone that you met. That's a water sign. And you went back to something familiar, someone that's a, a sword energy that's just completely doing you wrong still. But this water sign did nothing but love on you. There ain't nothing bad with this water sign. You ain't seen no seven of swords, five of swords, no sneaky energy. No weird shit, no shadow work, no none of that. That other person though that you're dealing with, that sword, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, is doing a lot of shadow work. And this person could very well not want you to talk to this water sign, this Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces energy. But I'm letting you know right now, you need to get away from this person. I'm telling you, they got a lot of evil intentions, that uh, sword energy. And if I were you, I wouldn't be dealing with nobody like that. I don't care if you got chemistry or kids with them. This person is just screaming bad energy, control tactics, and screaming, I could do whatever the fuck I want as long as you stay. And that's not how I work, but when you are a Sagittarius, you are a fire sign. You should not be staying somewhere that you don't want to be at or where somebody is hurting you. You're very independent. I know sometimes Sagittarius people, they tend to get comfortable and they stay in certain situations that is not good for them because y'all are y'all are mutable signs. So y'all tend to just move where, you know, y'all can, can easily shift anywhere. 
this ain't somewhere you want to be at. You want love and happiness and uh, pleasure that could outweigh the pain. And this is where you need to be right here. Somebody really do want to be with you. A water sign on top of that. And water and fire makes water and fire make a boil. So ain't nothing wrong with a little boy and a little steam. Until next time, Sagittarius. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you didn't, shit, that's on you. You can like it. You can get, you get downs it. You don't got to comment. You ain't got to say shit. I'm just blessed to see y'all here. Until next time, bye.